the, the most prestigious place to get a degree in Sanskrit is not any Indian place. It, it's a toss-up between Harvard, Heidelberg, Harvard, Harvard, Chicago, Chicago uh, Columbia. You know, Columbia, you know, maybe Oxford, Heidelberg, these kind of few places. If you go to Banaras Hindu University, you go to Karnataka Sanskrit University, very traditional. You go to the top universities, Sanskrit uh, universities in Chennai. I have been doing that tour. You go to Delhi University Sanskrit. You ask uh, the young people, where would you rather get a degree? They all tell you, they'd rather get the degree there. And where, where do you publish your paper to be known? You publish in one of those journals. And where, which is And the obviously part? then you write it in English. You write, no, right. And you also submit to what will be accepted. The referees will keep rejecting. In fact, two or three people in my talks, in the talks I've been having, two or three of the panelists gave their experiences that they, they had a certain interpretation. That's the traditional interpretation. It would keep getting rejected. And the, to, bring, to uh, be allowed to speak at an international conference, they had to self-settle for something that the other guys would accept. 